Hey everyone, my vegan cuts box arrived and I can't wait to share with you what's inside. My name is Kristen Lajeunesse and you're watching We'll Travel for Vegan Food. We'll travel for, we'll travel for vegan food. A few weeks ago you might remember that I shared with you three products that were going to be inside the April Vegan Cuts snack box. Now I have my own and I want to share with you the rest of the items that I got this month. Now as a reminder, in case you missed that video or you're unfamiliar with Vegan Cuts, they are a monthly subscription online program where you sign up and you get every month delivered to your door 7 to 10 vegan snack products. They also do specialty boxes like uh, men's grooming and yoga and fun things like that every now and then. They also have regular beauty boxes as well. So Carlos the cat is going to help me show, show you what's inside the April snack box. So here's a cool thing. In every snack box you get a little card that shares with you all the products that are in each um, box. So if you're ever wondering what it is or you want to learn more about the company or the brand, you can check it out on the card that they provide you in the box. Now as you know, my favorite things from uh, the preview that I did, um, and in fact <laughs> I couldn't wait to eat them before doing this unboxing video, so I already opened them, but you know they're, <laughs> they're the sour beans and fruit snacks by Yum Earth Organics. So we have those that were in this month's snack box. I absolutely love these things. They're so delicious. I can't get over how good those are. Okay, you also know from the previous unboxing that we have the Flamous um, Falafel Chips. Now what I'm excited about is that this time I got the spicy ones in the sampler that I had. Um, I had the regular ones which were amazing with hummus. And so this time I get to try the spicy ones and they look absolutely fantastic. I can't wait to give those a whirl. And of course, from the, uh, the preview video that I did earlier in the month, <laughs> we also had the Thai coconut curry popcorn by Pop Art. You might remember this. Um, so good. I love this. I can't wait to try their other flavors. I did have an opportunity to try their uh, rosemary, was it rosemary basil or something like that? So, so good. Um, so Pop Art. Love their branding and packaging, really good stuff. Okay, next up, this the following stuff will be new to me, so I might use my cheat sheet card here. Okay, we have Crunch Master, multigrain crackers that are tasty, gluten-free alternative to processed wheat crackers. Okay, let's check it out. So here we go, multigrain, sea salt, Crunch Master, wheat-free, gluten-free crackers. Those look mighty tasty. Next up we have R.W. Garcia. They're a blue corn, blue and yellow corn tortilla chip. They're gluten free, no trans fats. Those look pretty good too. And actually, if I drop them for you, they'll taste better. Uh, I did already open these as well because I was very excited to give them a try. So we've got these guys, which are great. Also, Explore Asian noodles made from beans and water for a healthy, delicious pasta dish. Well, I'm really excited to try these. Organic edamame spaghetti, or as my grandfather would have said, spaghetti in Italian. <laughs> these look really good. I can't wait to give these a whirl. These are gluten-free, organic, and kosher, and they look looks really, really good. Next up we have Vibrant Health Raw Protein Powder to help you get your daily greens while you are on the go. Here we have it, Vibrant Health Plant Protein Powder. This is going to be great for me because I make smoothies every morning and I usually put some kind of plant-based protein powder in them, so I'll definitely give that a try. All right, next up we have Grab the Gold, a snack bar that combines chocolate and peanut butter for a protein punch. Well, I have a feeling that I'm going to love this one. Oh my gosh. No high fructose corn syrup, no preservatives, zero trans fats, dairy-free, vegan, high in fiber. This, they're speaking my language when they start talking about chocolate and peanut butter mixed together. So that is probably delicious. And finally we have Dog Dark Organic, an all-natural energy drink to help power you through the day. Well, this will be a first for me because I've never tried any of the energy drinks that are out on the market. So 
Um, I suppose I could give this a whirl instead of getting my mocha lattes that I sometimes have in the afternoons when I'm feeling that lull. Although I should probably just have a green juice instead, right? <laughs> but yeah, this looks pretty interesting. I can't um, can't wait to give this one a try. I think it'll be it'll be good. I wonder how it'll taste. It's green tea, seven vitamins, energy drink. I like the purple packaging. So there you have it. We just together unboxed the April Vegan Cut Snack Box. I hope that you enjoyed sharing with me what's inside. Jump on over to vegancuts.com, sign up for your monthly subscriptions so that every month you will have a new surprise awaiting at your door with vegan goodies. Remember, they also have beauty boxes and they do specialty boxes every now and then as well. Um, I've had nothing but amazing and really interesting products come when I've gotten the boxes and they're usually things that I've never heard about or that might be hard to find on the market or in my local um, area. So it's nice to be able to try those where I might otherwise not be able to. Thanks again for watching everyone. I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please subscribe and jump on over to WTFveganfood.com and sign up for email updates so that you don't miss a single video. Thanks again and I'll catch you next time on Will Travel for Vegan Food.